Good morning, sunshines. Today, I decided that I was going to share some of my biggest secrets, my, my tricks, my uh, mastery of deception. <laughs> with Instagram or just photos in general. They don't have to be put anywhere in particular, but I thought I would help us shorties out and give some of my tips for how I trick people into thinking I'm a lot taller than I am because I tend to get that a lot at meetups and whatnot. Almost every person that I meet will say, Nikki, or you're so much shorter in person, or I thought you were taller, etc. And I'm quite small, so it makes sense. But I know people think that I seem to look taller in my photos, and I have some tricks for that. So I'm gonna give you guys like five tips to look taller in your photos. You're welcome. So step one is the toe point, okay? Every picture I take, you have to you have to point your toe, you know? So you want the illusion to be like this whole thing is your leg. So when I toe point, it makes this whole leg look longer. Now you can do it from the side too because I like to, you know, show my butt also. So when I'm putting all my weight on one hip, still have to toe point because otherwise this leg will look so, so short. So then I point it out like this. It's an illusion. It's all an illusion, okay? That is how I would do it from the side. <laughs> Also, tip number two, which I'm just gonna give as I am explaining tip number one, you always wanna elongate your body. It's always gonna make you look taller. So hands and arms, I always try to raise them in some way, find some excuse to like touch something, grab something, hold something, because you have to elongate all five feet of your torso <laughs> and legs to look taller. I feel like this is kind of self-explanatory, but I do think people ask this a lot and I'm like, well, obviously I'm cheating the system. You're welcome. Another great way to trick people into thinking you're taller is to just don't take pictures with your feet in them. If I think, if I don't toe point or I did something to where my leg won't look long, I just cut myself off at the knee. So most of the time, I'll do pictures from about this angle, knees and up, because then you can't tell how tall someone is. I'm still doing my best to elongate my arms or body in any way, shape, or form. I also think high-waisted pants really help. I guess it's like tip number three is like, the clothing that you're wearing. So high-waisted pants, your legs look longer, assuming it's like a long pant. And also, to make your legs look longer in general, not just taller, it's either short shorts or long pants. But anything in the middle, like biker shorts or capris or whatever this stuff is, that's gonna make your legs look shorter, even if it's kind of cute sometimes still anyway. It will chop you off if you have short legs like me. Some people are kind of short, like Robin, for example. I think she's 5'3 or 5'4, so taller than me, but still pretty short. And she has a long, she has, she has long legs and a short torso, so I feel that she doesn't have to force an illusion as much. Or me, I have short ass legs and a long-ish torso proportionately. Max is like, what are you doing gesturing with your arms so aggressively? Do you love the camera? Do you love the YouTube? All right, I have a couple more tips for you. So, when other people are taking pictures of you, so when I'm taking a picture in a mirror, obviously I'm just holding this at about chest height, whatever, you can't really change that that much because it would look weird if you were like down here or up here. There's only so much you can change there. However, when other people are taking photos of you, if your feet are in the photo, then you want the photo or the camera to be as low as possible. If your feet are not in the photo, then your face will look better if the camera's up here. Does that make sense? You're gonna get better lighting with a camera that's angled this way, assuming there is direct lighting on your face but if you want to look taller you're showing up a whole outfit shoes included etc and your main goal is to look taller you want to take your pictures from down low so for example if I was trying to take a picture of Bernard and make him look tall I would literally be like on the ground like this wow you look so tall man but like so and Bernard will look quite tall you know what I'm saying? Another tip, this is like for small people in general. So not necessarily just height, well yeah, height. Tip number five, I guess. Besides taking pictures low, this is when you're in pictures with other people. The struggle I have is like, I'm five foot one, ish, I'm a little under probably. And Whitney, for example, is 5'5 five five or 5'6. Five so she's a lot taller. So if I'm taking a picture with Whitney, let's pretend, I guess Bernard is me and I'll be Whitney because we want Bernard to be the shorter one. So I'll stand a little bit in front of her because it puts me close to the camera, which therefore makes me look a little bit bigger, which you can only do so much with, you know, your height, but it helps a little bit. So if you're the shorter one, you wanna stand in front in the picture. And then also you wanna have whoever's taking the picture, take it diagonally so that it cuts the height difference a little bit if that makes sense. So in this one, if we were taking a picture, Max, I need you to pretend to take it. Take it like so. I'll put like a box around this. <laughs> Instead of taking it just straight on where the height difference is just 
super apparent. So I think that's important. And then since I'm just so tiny in general, I just tend to try to stand ahead in pictures to make me look a little bigger, a little taller, whatever. Also helps for your butt if you're going for that, which you don't have to be. Yeah, Mix, are those all of our tips? I am sorry, sir. What did I do to you? What's the matter? You just want attention? I think that's pretty much all I have for you. Those are the main things that I'm always thinking of if I'm taking a picture. I hate looking short in pictures, even though I am. Not that I'm trying to hide who I am, I just, I just don't think it looks flattering in a photo. So elongating your body as much as humanly possible. Lots of this will make you look a lot taller, make your limbs look longer. Yeah, I always twist my waist because I don't have any hips or anything going on here. So that's that. Those are my tips. I hope I, I tried to make that like short and sweet, not going overboard when you know what I'm talking about. But let me know if you guys have any other tips that you can think of off the top of your head because I would love more, always. More is always better. <coughs> so let me know down below or let me know what your favorite tip was down below because I'm curious if you haven't maybe thought of any of these before or maybe they're all obvious to you. I don't know. Let me know down below. Make sure you click that subscribe button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for new videos. Like the video or dislike it if you didn't like it, either way. And that's all from me. I hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next video. Ta-ta for now. Bye.